welcome to the channel. The wifey is very excited because today we are going to Shikatik, Tom's Cove, and the beast is going to be in Virginia on sand for the first time. You excited? It's the plan, anyway. Yep. Anything can happen in Smitty Heady Love. That is true. They could say, hey, you're not allowed on there. There could already be 11 people. We could be too heavy. We could be too beastly for that part of the island. I doubt it. We meet all the requirements height-wise and all that tires and stuff. Too beastly. So what are you doing right now? Well, our old tire gauges, <laughs> <laughs> they, uh, they took a crap. So we um, filled up our tires yesterday blindly. We didn't do too bad. I mean, we got one at 46, one at 39, one at 50, and one at 64. So but, there you go. But today, since you know we're doing something different, we decided to uh, to not really chance it, and uh, we bought new air gauges. And they're bitch to open. And what's the real kicker? That they're seeing ones that took oh. a, took a poop. Yeah. So. You know, they'll only last about a year. Or two. I or two. two. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. I tried to find a mechanical gauge, and unfortunately, Home Depot doesn't have them. So, we're going digital. They're only nine bucks a pop, but. Yeah, buddy, they work. So, let's go. with our new JT Brooks auto deflators pro version. Having these things are a must. I know I've said it before and I'll say it again and I'll say it every time I'm doing a video on the beach. things are a must. Oh, I said, savers. Yeah, I said I said it before and I'll say it again. My wife has my wife has dubbed these the marriage saver. Sure. So if you go off roading with your wife, marriage saver. Yep. Yeah I think these work pretty well. Yeah. Let's see how they did. See how close they got. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait. Takes a little bit from the oh, reset. 21. All right. So we set that. We set them right between 20 and 25. Up oh, 19 on the one. And these and the, the TPS sensors are not 100% accurate either. But it's it's right where I want it to be. 19 on the front left. There it goes, 19. Oh man, on 19. Good work. Hey man, I'll just adjust the one in the back a little bit. Beach cruising. Oh 
it would help if I put it in four wheel drive and took the traction control off. Rookie. Rookie. Exploring with Smitty and Hetty on Ram Beast projects. We're on Chicoteague Island and we've discovered an old abandoned U.S. Coast Guard station. Assateague Beach Station. <laughs> oh, I think something's biting my foot. Ah, now they're little furs. Holy f Really cool. I'm not sure when they decommissioned this uh, station, but it's definitely neat. I would imagine probably in the 60s or 70s. According to Wikipedia, the uh, station was first built in 1874 and it was facing out towards the ocean. But in 1922, due to shifting topography, it was relocated to where it is now here. And the old boathouse was converted into a garage in 1938, 1939. And oh my God, he actually knows what he's talking about. It was decommissioned in 1967. Ah, see, I was close. That's crazy. And it was turned over to the National Park Service and the new National Seashore. I'm gonna attempt to check out an old dock. I think this is the old fishing factory. Or old fishing factory. I could be wrong, I don't know. Or she can be wrong. I'm not usually wrong though, people. <laughs> ow, ow, I'm getting bit. There. Go check out the old abandoned Coast Guard station, she says. It'll be fun, she said. Meanwhile, we're getting eaten alive. These bugs are out of control. She made that look a lot easier. We just walked through a spider web. Huh, you did. Thank you. What the heck? I didn't think there were spiders on island. What is that? There, there's, there's like straight bone. Where? It's an old, it's a fish. A bird probably dropped that. Yeah, one. definitely. Uh, looks like the dock's pretty much gone. birds only birds relax I don't know oh, yeah, like back here. a train there's like tracks over here probably for ships to load yeah. I'm taking a picture of this this is awesome. check this out Cool. 
All right, well, that was fun. Something different, something you don't see every day. Now we're gonna hop back in the beast and do a little bit more exploring and... Uh, Stay tuned for the lighthouse. Yeah, lighthouse. And then we're out, back to Maryland. To check out the lighthouse. Yes, we're exploring again. Exploring. Fortunately, it looks like it's closed, so we're not going to be able to climb the stairs to the top. How come you didn't make uh, Todd and Dawn see Shelter Street? Oh, that's pretty slick. <laughs> Todd must really love Dawn. Alright, well, maybe next time. Okay. Womp, womp. Let's go back to Ocean City, Maryland. So we're back on the Maryland side of Assateague using what my wife dubs as the merit savers. And we picked up some stragglers. Say hi, guy. Hi! He's also using merit savers. Get ready to hit the sand. fact about Assateague Island. Yeah. It is a barrier island that continues to roll over itself into the bay. If you didn't and know how that. How do we know that? We know that because about a half a mile up there are tree stumps in the sand going into the ocean and at first you'd be like oh my god why are there tree stumps in the sand right by the ocean? Oh you want to know why? Because it keeps rolling. Rolling. <laughs> hey guy what do you think? Did you know that? <laughs> well, Assateague Island? Area, I learned bad. it was what? The bay. The bay, yeah. The bay, yeah. <laughs> the, the not your bay, not your bay. The bay, the bay, bay, yeah. bay yeah. Not your bacon and eggs. Bay, yeah. bay yeah. And then the ocean was out there, but it just rolled.
I might moon you. <laughs> On camera. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give us a thumbs up. Or you if you're might stopping see a by turtle head. <laughs> If you're stopping by for the first time, please subscribe. If you haven't been to Assateague Island on the OSV and you have a 4x4 truck, Ram, Jeep, whatever, you got to come out here. It's awesome. You can go to Shikateek side or Assateague with your uh, OSV permit. You got to check it out sometime. And if you haven't already, check out rambeastprojects.com to get your Ram Beast merch. And also check out our Facebook, Ram Beast Projects, our Twitter, Ram Beast Projects, and Instagram. Ram Beast Projects. Thank you and have a great weekend. Bye bye.